Hey, what up, fellow bass players? It's your boy, Ray J, coming at you another Basement Boy production, trying to get the lighting right. About to do Finish Strong by Jonathan Nelson. I had to semi play it at this conference this past Saturday. So it's not a hard song, it's just you gotta be aware of the transitions, basically. Because a lot of things is just off timing, kind of. So, and that just means it's not on the one. So, it's all good. So, what I do, I just I break the song down. It's in the key of E flat, and it modulates the F, then they do craziness at the end. But I just give you a way that you can, you know, end it or whatnot, where it's just simple. All right, so I'm going to play the part first, and then I'm going to break the part down. Then, as we get more parts after I play I'm gonna let you hear how it should sound alright so let's start with the intro <clears throat> so you got the keyboard thing. then the first thing is alright that intro in the key of E flat Five, six, one, two, three, one, four, seven, one, two, three. All right, and that actually goes into the first verse. So all together, and actually the the notes that the the chords that the keyboard is hitting is three, four, then flat five. Flat six, then six. Ah, uh, all right. And that's actually that F, that two to the three is actually part of the verse. All right, so again. I'm playing the verse. And that last part I did just goes into the chorus. All right, so all the verses: two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five. And when you hit four, five for the second time, you come, you hit the six, six, four, three. It just takes the place of the two, three, four, five, two, three. Four, five, then you hit six. Uh, 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 uh. All right, it's just like a, like I said, it's just an off timing. So, uh, uh. strong finish. Dun, dun. And actually, the verse and the chorus is play exactly are the exact same notes. Only thing different because we play the bass is that the bass player just just does like slap pluck fills or whatnot and I can just give you something simple or whatnot. So strong finish. Alright, and that's basically what he does. back to the second you go to the second verse so the first chorus six five four three four five then you slap you slap and pluck seven one so uh 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 strong finish four five strong faith so that's strong faith then two three again then you could just like slap and pluck you know just the you could do like three three four three two four five seven one alright so again at 
the beginning of the chorus. That's where I'm at. So y'all won't be confused. Uh, 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 uh. Strong fitness. Uh, uh. Strong finish, strong faith. All right, so that is mainly how every chorus is played. All right, and again, all I was doing is that's six, five, four, three, four, five, seven, one, two, three, four, five. Seven, one, two, three, four, five, seven, one, two, three, three, one, four, seven, five. Then you go back into the verse, uh, just how you begun the song with the two, three walk up. Uh -huh. All right, so let's play all what we have together. We have the intro, we have the first verse, and we have the chorus. So here we go. And just go back to the exact same bass line that you was playing the first verse with. The same six four three. Now, at this change to go into the chorus, they do something different. So when you get to that three, to the two, three, uh, uh, then they hit C sharp, C sharp, E flat, or flat seven, one, two, then you do five, four, three. And back to the regular same chorus. The chorus is always played the same throughout the whole song, all right? It's just maybe leading up to the chorus, they may do a quick change, or after the chorus, they do a change, but the chorus is always played the same, all right? And the chorus is strong finish, strong faith, all right? So, again, let's do it again. Second chorus, I mean, second verse. Here come that C sharp. Mm, uh, uh, uh. Strong finish is the same thing. Strong faith. All right. So again, that change. That's at the end of the verse to go to the second chorus again. It's C sharp, flat seven, one, two, five, four, three, four, five, seven, one, two, three. This is the chorus. Four, five, seven, one, two, three. Four, five, seven, one, two, three, three. Five, I mean, three, one, four, strong, faith, seven, one. Now, here's the here's the victory chant. Strong, finish, strong, finish, strong, strong, faith. And that's the, that's, you call it a victory chant or the strong chant. And the notes is that, for this is, three, four, 
three one six, then you just repeat it going the same way. Six one three, four five six, seven one. Everybody say strong finish. Three one six, six one three, four five six, seven one, six one. Me three one six is the first one. Second one is six one three. The third one is four five six. The last one is seven one. All right. And then after they do that like twice, they break and they go back to how the intro came in. Now this part is like, you call this the, the bridge. Well this is the bridge. Just to go to a next key when you just repeat the same thing. Yeah, the bridge to take you to F. Then you repeat the chorus and then you do the vamp. Okay. So the bridge is God promised he will be with me through every step that I take and every Yeah, okay, so God promised I'm gonna play it. So And that little transition takes me to F. So God promise, you just stay on the six. God promise, he will seven, one, through every step is flat seven. Reset that I take two. Then five through raise. Then you go to the six, which is C. Now when you hit this C, that's when that's how they modulate. That C which is the 6 in E flat now becomes the dominant or the 5, the 5th note in the F major scale. That becomes the 5 in the F major scale. And that's how they take it up. So God promise will be with me through every step that I take. By her grave, uh, 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 strong finish. Uh, uh. Back to the chorus. And all I'm doing is. Uh, uh. So that's just three, four, three, two, three. It's just I'm plucking it. I'm slapping it, I meant. Seven, one. Alright. Then they do the same exact thing. Strong finish. Strong faith. Go to the strong finish strong chant. Strong three one six. Six one three. Four five six. Seven one again. Three one six one. I mean six one three four five six seven one. Then after this is the vamp, and that's when they everybody say oh 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 oh. oh. All right, and all that is is three four, then five, then you repeat it. Uh, three. And that's what I do. He, I don't think the bass player really does it, but they have so many instruments where he don't need to do it. So what I do, and you can't go wrong going to the one. So all I do is three, four, five, seven, one, uh, uh, three, four. 
five, seven, one, I'm doing it. Three, open A. Four, five, seven, one. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. say oh. Oh, 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 oh. Da, 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 da. Strong finish. Da, da. Strong faith. Mm -hmm. Strong finish. Mm -hmm. Strong faith. And that's how you get ended. Just ended on a strong faith. Strong finish. Strong faith. And that's pretty much the whole song. They do other stuff, but most likely you won't do that. So I don't want to, you know, teach it. It's just like off notes. Sorry, man. Sorry, man. Say. Yeah. All right. And a little lick I did there was when I. And all that was is, you know, if you've been following any of my teachings or whatnot, when I do licks, I love just on a D and a G string, kind of like letting them ring a little bit together. So, so say, say. All right, okay. So what it, the the notes are two. Five, four, three, the high, the high numbers I'm giving you. Same numbers, just I'm not, I'm just hitting an octave. So, two, five, four, three, one, the octave one, five, and we're in the key of F, one, the root, and then four. So, all together, I catch the three, I catch the three, which is the A, on the high A, then I do, what's the name, so if you, so here it goes regular. So, so I caught that, oh, oh, oh. So you can even do that even if you don't want to do a whole lick you say the high hit your high A. Oh I don't know if that's the exact notes that they're hitting, but it sounds like they could be. And you're hitting a one. You don't go wrong hitting a one, the four or the five. Trust me. I did it on uh this past Saturday when I had to play. I didn't know what note he was hitting, so I sustained on the one or on the five. And just played around that. Like you just gotta fake it until you know what you're doing. So when all those fell, sustain on the one, the four, or the five, and you'll be alright. Trust me. So again, I come, I hit the the one on the high, but I just keep moving. Alright, so you just do that just just the high octave three, octave one, five. I mean octave three, octave one, to hit the regular four. Oh, 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 everybody say oh, 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 oh. I messed that up. Oh shoot. sometimes like you experiment like 
you can sub note the hit note for the root note and just come just your next note you just come on it you can do that as well that's what I was doing so and this is like kind of like a lesson into this so I just do a, a lesson on just substituting notes or whatnot alright but that's the lesson let me know if it was too fast for some or you know just give me y'all feedback with the lesson so with that it's over and out peace